Hello everybody, my name is Kristen and welcome to my channel. I thought I would give you guys a quick update on everything that's been happening with my foot. This would be part three now because I think I'm finally at the stage of like, this is it. This is after this, I won't have much more else to show. So this will be the last video. There is some graphic material of my stitches being cut out. I will make sure that I put a timestamp on when that is for the video. But other than that, please enjoy. So I just got back from from urgent care to see the podiatrist. He took my foot out of the cast. Yeah, the nurse at the hospital had made a little map of blood so I could like at least assess if it was getting any worse. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. That was nice. Yeah. But it didn't, it, mm -mm. Yeah. no. It How long were you in the hospital? Um, I, how long was I in there? A few hours, eh? Should have dropped you off at 11 and then get you out till like 5.36. Yeah. Just being real careful on this part, okay? Oh, that's, that's for my poking stick. Oh, yeah. Oh. I was wondering, like, what is that? Yeah, it's bamboo. Oh, no. That's all I could find was a, um, a skewer mm -hmm. that I could like for cook in. Yeah. That's all I could find for itch, and I had to do something. Yeah, well be done. careful, because it can scratch, and you won't yeah, find what it's like. I was trying to use the non-pokey side. I was trying to use the blunt side. I think that was from the one that you had handed me that was all splintered, and I was like, no, I can't use that one. Feeling it's okay so far? Yeah. Okay. Also feels a lot cooler. What she's cutting right now, it was that piece right there, it was too tight. Mm -hmm. It was driving my ankle nuts. And I also felt like I had tape wrapped all around my ankle too. Sharp, but that's they have the protection. Well, that's what I mean. I'm looking at that. Yeah, that's right. Yeah, they find it like summer Bible school <laughs> camp or some, something. Mm. That's why it's been itching in there. You're going to need a bath. <laughs> your I should say your hoof is. Oh, yeah. I'm guessing that didn't Are come. Are you able to lift your foot? Yeah. Your tattoo is gone. <laughs> How it goes off real easy. Okay, if it's too dry, now get some saline or something. That's okay. Mm. So far, so good. Okay, perfect. 
happened. Nice. Good. Sometimes the stitches are connected to that one, so I'm going to let the doctor take that one off, okay? Yeah. Well. Your foot still looks jacked up. Yep. <coughs> oh, yeah. I mean, this had surgery. Yellow stuff. <laughs> That's all you're getting. <laughs> I also forgot my phone, so I had someone else film for me. And now my foot. And he also he took out all the stitches. Mm -hmm. I just remember it was trippy as hell. Well. Yeah. Yeah, my dog dog. got her oh. leg severed off a few years ago. Oh no. And that's how her leg is reinforced is with two so, plates and no kidding. So they have to do some orthopedic veterinary surgery, huh? Yeah. Oh. Yep, I was in California working in Berkeley and I got a phone call. Yeah. It's just like, oh, you know, oh man. man. Dog's only like a year and a half old. Oh, no. And it's like, mm. poor dog. Yep, drove to Iowa to go get her. Yeah, jeez. You know, pure, a purebred hunting dog. And, oh, really? <laughs> yeah. She, she gave the dog she she gave. And we're able to get photos of x rays. My foot is still really swollen, but it is in a boot right now. And I'm gonna take my foot out of my boot so I can start doing my physical therapy and stretching my foot. And the doctor said in two weeks, I can start putting some weight on the foot, not completely, not do complete weight load bearing, whatever they say, but I can at least like start putting a little bit of weight on my foot and stretching it and I mean that's promising in two weeks and then in a month I go in and I see him for it looks so crazy right now also I have not been getting any sleep because of the cast but in a month I go back in and I see him and get x-rays and then is that that's all the appointment is for is just to get x-rays no in a month oh and and then then I don't know what after what he'll tell me after that I guess I'll probably be able to start doing load bearing weight exercises maybe I don't know we'll see but that's that okay first round of physical therapy here we go we're doing our alphabets okay, okay. B and I'm also watching. Cajun Pawn Stars. <laughs> if you're wondering, we'll, we'll turn that down. C. Ooh, okay, not bad. D. And I can't use my knee or my thigh. I've got to just let it sit here. Okay, what are we on? Okay, do I just do lower? Yeah, I do lower KC, right? Okay, yeah. E. Okay. F. Okay, G. Ooh. Hmm. Can we, do I have to stop? Maybe we might have to stop at G. Oof. Hmm. My foot hurts. Ooh, I think G's it. I think that's it for today. So we'll just go. I'll try and turn it so I can. And stretch, and stretch, do this as much as possible, we stretch, and stretch, oh man. You can see how swollen my foot is right there. And all swollen my toes still are. Yeah, my toes are still really swollen. They're pretty, pretty Pretty pudgy, but that's okay. That's okay. I'm just gonna do one more stretch. 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 I think that's good. Oh. 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 Oh my god, we're having an earthquake right now. Oh my god, it's still going on. Can you see everything shaking? Probably not. Look at me. 
Oh my god, I've never experienced one this long before. Oh my. You see, it's still happening. See the cord behind me is moving? Friday, July 9th. Um, I just woke up like not too long ago. I'm sure you can tell. My eyes still are like. I. It's finally. Last night was finally the first night where I actually got good sleep but then around six o'clock I was woken up by my rude neighbors Wednesday I went to the hospital or urgent care I should say and I got my cast taken off which I mean honestly thank goodness for that because you and I mean especially if you're like claustrophobic like myself having anything stuck to you permanently like that that you can't get out of is mm, it's horrible and I don't even know how else to explain it. That's why I wasn't getting any, any good sleep because I kept waking up in the middle of the night freaking out. And I didn't know why I was freaking out. It was because this thing was on my foot. Plus, it was super painful. It was on, like, I'm not really sure if, like, my foot kept slipping out of place in the cast or what, but my heel was pushed up against the back of the cast the majority of the time. Even if I had my foot elevated, it was still irritated all the time I couldn't get any sleep always in pain I was not in pain from the surgery itself that was fine it was this pain from the cast now I did get and also if you hear a noise in the background my air conditioners on because it's 100 degrees out you know I'm not dealing with that right now I did get asked a lot of questions about you know being in the cast being injured one person in particular I will shout them out because they asked to and sure why not but his name is Brad um, I think he's younger because he had a lot of questions about what's it like to have your foot in a cast he always wanted to have his foot in a cast or leg in a cast whichever I can't re say more than don't do it you don't want a broken leg you don't want a broken foot you don't want to have to go through this pain See, when I broke my foot, I not only just broke it, I dislocated the toe. And the doctor had to reset my toe. And I didn't get foot video of that just because, at it, why? No one wants to see that. No one wants to hear that. And I'm pretty sure YouTube probably would have demonetized me or something. But I don't know why I say that like I'm monetized. I don't get paid. Anyways. Um, <clears throat> but in the future, if I ever did get paid... I wouldn't have been getting paid for that one because, ew. Also, um, you can't do anything. You can't go nowhere. You're literally, I, this, this spot right here in the corner of the couch, this has been my spot for the last three weeks now. I don't get to go nowhere. I don't get to move. I, like, now, for kids, all they want to do is play. As adults, all you want to do is work. Um... As long as you have a job you love to do, which I do. Otherwise, I haven't been doing anything like that. I've just been like quick little short trips around here because I can't really afford to do much. But it has been driving me nuts because I can't sit in the car that long. My foot starts to hurt. It's it's a whole thing. You don't want to break your leg. I'm just telling you, don't do it. You don't want to break your foot. My, my foot is broken. But the kid kept saying about breaking a leg, having a cast... Oh, it must be really fun to have everyone signing your cast. I mean, as a child, as a kid, I see people, I can see how people would be signing your cast. As an adult, no one's signing your cast. That's the person, the only person that signed my cast was the nurse there, and she didn't technically sign it. She just made a little map outline of my blood that was on my cast. So I knew if it got more bloody, that was about it. Otherwise, I am, I don't know. I don't know who would want anything, any bone of theirs to be broken. I had to get surgery because of how bad I dislocated my toe and now I've got metal everywhere throughout my foot. I may have to deal with that in the future. I might be irritated by this metal. They might have to go back in and take some of it out. It's like a whole thing. No, you don't want this. You don't want this. So anyways, I will be, I do want to say thank you to everybody though. Thank you to everybody that has sent me warm, kind wishes and, you know, a speedy recovery. And, you know, thank you so much for that because that really does help. It makes my day kind of like 
a little bit better since I can't do much and lets me know people are actually care a little bit. It is nice. So anyways, I'm going to upload this Monday because a lot happened in this past week that I took off. Figured I might as well just get it done and over with now on Monday. And Thursday I will get right back in to uploading videos. I have one from Vegas from a few years ago that I filmed again. I used to film every, I still film everything I do, but I used to film everything I did without a reason or a rhyme. I just did it. Now I know I was doing it in preparation for this channel. I didn't know then, but now I do. <laughs> Let's take off this boot. I have the um, flash on. And again, please ignore my messy camper because I am like all this over here, all everything in here I am currently packing because I'm moving. <laughs> and since it's just, it, it's just my husband doing it all right now. So things are just a little bit chaotic because, you know, he's doing it all alone. But hopefully I can help here soon. So we're going to take her foot out of the boot. I got to wear it for when I hobble around. Okay, and then we, we velcro those back because otherwise they stick to everything and then we can't find them. Same with these. Got to velcro these back. And themselves because otherwise they... There we go. That'll be good. And that way we can start our physical therapy. All right. Up out of the boot. Oh, I got some bruising. Um, oh, yeah, she's tad tight. So, oh, that feels so good to stretch my foot this way. Oh, I would say right up here because there's a metal bar right here. I feel that the most when I stretch. So I'm trying to, I'm trying to hold that spot, this position for as long as I can stand it. It is really annoying though. Come back, forward, back. My range of movement is way better from the first day when they took me, my foot out of the cast. Also, my husband wrapped my, hmm, I'm not too sure about this, but, so we're just going to do our physical therapy, which is just, um, doing the alphabet with our foot, and then, yeah, and that's about it. So, anyways, I thought I would just keep you all updated on, yeah, what's been happening. Now, from here on out. From here on out, my foot's basically, you know, I'm out of the cast. They got the stitches out of my foot. Do you want to see that? I don't want to rewrap my foot. Maybe I'll try and get video of my foot the next time I get my foot unwrapped. Because I do have to put, I think I need to get some Neosporin on it because it is a tad sore. <clears throat> but anyways. So I'm just going to continue my physical therapy. And like I said, from here on out, it's just going to be my foot just in recovery. And I won't really have much more to show you because I'm done with the cast. I'm done with surgery. I hope you enjoy this. And I will see you all later. Bye. Okay, well, that's my foot. Oh, man, does that look bad? It's still really swollen. I decided to take the ace bandage off. Oh, watch out, doggy. I decided to take the ace bandage off for a moment just to kind of let like you know my incision air out a little bit because it's just been stuck in that thing and yeah it looks so bad though it's a, it's a lot nicer when it's hidden at the moment oh god yeah. I still plaster on my foot in some areas but yeah.